Hello, South Jersey. Mike Frankel in with your SNJ Today Sports. Call it rekindling a rivalry. Millville and Bridgeton only separated by about 15 miles, but the two schools are just getting to know one another again on the football field. The Thunderbolts versus the Bulldogs is our SNJ Today game of the week. We check in with the Bolts first as Millville is hard at work on the practice field. It had been 15 years since the Bolts faced the Bulldogs before the teams met last season. That won a lopsided Bridgeton victory. But a lot has changed since then, including the Thunderbolts head coach, Dennis Thomas, now running the program after coming over from Salem High School. Thomas has his squad off to a 3-2 and two start, which includes wins over Mainland, Apsigami, and Ocean City. With the losses coming against non-public powers, St. Augustine and St. Joseph, the St. Joe loss in overtime. So a solid effort through five games for Millville, which has the Bolts right in the hunt for a Group 5 playoff spot. Of course, the focus this week is on Bridgeton and trying to beat the Bulldogs for the first time in almost two decades. I tell you what, the, the city's buzzing and uh, everyone's excited. I'm sure it's going to be a nice crowd at the game. Um, it's Friday night game, Friday night lights were in Bristol. You know, last year they beat us pretty bad here in Millville. You know, I would love to return a favor, but at the same time, uh, I realize that Bristol's a tough team. And in order to beat Bristol in Bristol, you know, you're going to have to bring your A game. Right now, we're not playing A game football, you know, so we, we have to do some really good things in order to come out with the win. Uh, we're really excited, especially after last year. We're hoping to get some uh, redemption on them, and I feel like we're we're getting really ready for this game. Violence is our rivalry. We consider this our rivalry, so we're going to come out here every day of the week and just act like it's rivalry week. Yeah, it's, it's exciting. It's like the next best rivalry besides the middle of violent game, and uh, especially where they got us last year, I think it's going to be an even more intense game to try and get some revenge on them. We make the short drive west on Route 49 now to check in with the Bulldogs. Almost a tale of two seasons in one for Dave Ellen's group as Bridgeton begins the season 0-3, but one was a three-point loss to Buna, another a two-point loss to Riverdale. The Bulldogs have since turned things around, winning their last three in a row, including an overtime victory over previously undefeated Cedar Creek and two lopsided wins against Pleasantville and Lower Cape May. Bridgeton actually moving up to South Jersey Group 4 this season, and a win over Millville could cement a spot in the playoffs. Ellen and company not concerned about the postseason just yet, just focused on beating the Bolts. You know, when I first started coaching here, they, they talked about the county uh, rival, you know, and uh, anytime you played Vinan or Millville, you know, uh, the stands were packed. My mom talks about, you know, you had to get there earlier. Uh, there were three deep along the fence, you know, and that's kind of what we're expecting uh, on Friday night. Definitely was a, a great atmosphere uh, last year. Just been working hard at practice, pushing each other, getting the job done. Just the intensity, just we, we were tired of losing. It's a lot of power points and a lot of bragging rights. To me, they just in a way. We, that's just a team we got to play this week. And it's a, it's a important game, but I ain't add nothing more to it. I ain't taking nothing, you know what I mean? Nothing less from it. Kickoff is set for 7 o'clock on Friday night in Bridgeton. You can watch the game live on SNJ Today Channel 22 in Greater Cumberland County or online at snjtoday.com. And you can watch highlights Saturday night on The Locker Room on SNJ Today and WACP. Kara, send it back over to you.